Keep me apprised of the situation, Ertl. We may need to take action. Ah, Sith. Sorry to keep you waiting. I hope your search in House Alde was fruitful. I've been anxiously dreaming up scandals we could catch the spotless Nomar Organa in. This should allow us to sink our hopes into him. Let me see. Engagement announcement Nomar and Rihanna. My goodness, this is juicy. It must have been somewhere between 20, 30 years ago. Long before I was born, but I remember hearing my nurses talking about it. The sister to the Lord of House Rist was engaged to a prominent noble against the wishes of both their families. The coward broke it off. Where is this girl now? What is she doing? Oh, Lady Rahana Rist has developed quite the reputation. Rist is a house of highly trained assassins, and Lady Rist is no exception. But she is perhaps most noted for her stubborn refusal to marry, and for the humiliations she pours on those who ask. She sounds like loads of fun. And more importantly, like she's still in love with Nomar Organa. And if she is still in love with Nomar, then you may be able to convince her to lure Nomar to Alderaan. <laughs> There's always lightning! If arguments fail, I have other ways. Whatever method you prefer, though I hope it doesn't come to that. But be wary. To reach Rohan Arist, you'll have to contend with the deadliest assassins on Alderaan. Good luck, Sith. I hope your search is going well, my lord. Ah, Sith. Dathis Elgin, Imperial Advisor to House Thule. Am I glad to see you? House Thule faces a crisis that threatens to undermine their entire position on Alderaan. And the Empire's as well. You'll have to tell me what this crisis is before I agree to anything. House Rist, Alderaan's House of Assassins, is currently aligned with the usurper House Ulgo. But there was a time when Rist did all manner of secret jobs for whomever paid. Now the dirty details of those jobs are threatening to get out. Dirty deeds! Damn dirt cheap! Um... Yawn. A former <laughs> wrist assassin, kicked out for revealing the identity of one of his employers, is blackmailing Thule. He says he'll reveal every assassination, every kidnapping, every conniving thing Thule has done unless we pay him. Just tell me where he is and I'll kill him. I'd rather not have him killed, if possible. It raises too many questions. We've arranged a meeting to deliver payment. But he's recruited some of Rist's best assassins to his side. I don't trust him. That's why I need you. Someone strong enough to withstand whatever trap he intends to spring. It's as good as done. This man wants to establish his own House of Assassins. And he has demanded land and a title as payment for his silence. Take this case and meet him at the assigned meeting place. If he takes the bribe, fine. If not, kill him. Didn't you just tell me not to? Well, brother, would you look at this? A Sith. I guess Thule isn't half as stupid as I thought. It won't do them any good, but I'd give them points for trying. Now, if you'd kindly hand over the payment. I'm not giving you a thing until I'm sure there are no tricks. Tricks? We've only just met. You already know me so well. I thought Thule would send some scrawny diplomat I could take hostage, but you... you'll fetch a higher price. And here I was just starting to like you. I'm going to enjoy kicking your face. Don't get your hopes up. We've been doing this our whole lives. I just started. <laughs> Uh, 
Kim. Probably shouldn't have stood in that fire, bro. Stop. Stop this guy. They have the better of us, and besides, it's not worth it. The evidence is already on its way to House Algo. He had no intention of giving it to you. What? what? You will all pay for this. Sam, you idiot! We could have been counts! You've lost all sense of honor. Lying and stealing? I swore to live by a code. The wonder with the evidence is delivering it to Algo's son, Vesix. Sam, you'd betray your own brother? I'll kill you for that! Damn it, Kai. I'm sorry. Ooh. Look, the coordinates the runner was headed to are in the console over there. You might be able to catch him if you hurry. I'll take Kai's assassins. I promise, neither you nor Thule will hear from us again. That's right. I won't. No one betrays me and lives. I take the fact that you were rummaging around in the Assassin's files to mean that the meeting didn't go well. The evidence has already gone to Ulgo. You're kidding me. Damn it! Well, spare no detail. If Vesix Ulgo gets that evidence, soon every house on Alderaan will know who Thule hired Riss to kill, and when. They won't just banish Thule, they'll destroy them. And the Empire's chances on Alderaan will die with them. I can't say I envy your position right now. I'm sorry, but I have to ask for your help once more. Of course Vesex Ulgo commands a squad of the most highly trained commandos on Alderaan. They have even defeated Jedi. I am no but Jedi. You, you may stand a chance. I have to ask you to recover that evidence, quickly. I suppose I can lower myself to do this. Thank you so much. Find the evidence. Destroy it. And I promise you'll double the reward when you return. Honey, I'm home! Congratulations, Sith. You've broken into my home, butchered my assassins, and forced your way into my personal chambers. Can I at least offer you a drink before you start making demands? The only thing I will drink is your blood. I'm afraid my blood is not on offer. Not without a fight, at any rate. So tell me then. What does Alana Thule want? I don't know about her, but I want to discuss Nomar Argana. Well, well. Let me guess. You dug this holo out of some dusty archive in House Alder. Let's just say that his royal Jedi-ness Nomar Organa and I are ancient history and leave that dead dog buried. <laughs> All these... Oh. Okay. I was about to say, all these answers are the same, but uh, no, no, they're not. There's one obvious choice. Tell me about Nomar Organa, or die. You think because you are Sith, you can intimidate me with threats. I've seen more of I, you I than either you or that little bird, Thule, and you won't get anything out of me without a fight. You want to help, Kem? Maybe? I'll call him. No more Organa's not worth dying for. But then I want you out of my home. Oh, yeah, yeah, whatever. Sure. 
You're hardly in a position to make demands. No. I suppose not. Let me bring him up. Ancient history, yet I have him on speed dial. Rohana, what, what a surprise. I know, it, it must be. Nomar, there's something I need to talk to you about. Go ahead. Anything I can do. Anything at all. <laughs> not, Get on with it. Not like this. It's a favor I need, here on Alderaan. I was hoping we could meet. Of course. I can be there in a few hours. The old place? Yes. The old place. Thank you. There. Are you happy now? <sighs> Where will he be? Oh yeah, I probably should do that first. Tell me about this meeting place. <laughs> <laughs> that never gets old. I'll give you the coordinates. But I won't come with you. And you'd better get out of here. The meeting spot is in an underground cave near House Cortez. But the entrance tunnels are filled with Kilix. So good luck. Hmm. I believe her, yet I, I just don't care. You're trying to get me killed. Is that it? <laughs> I can't say I'd miss you, Sith. Now get out of my house! Tell me you've defeated Vesix. Tell me you managed to destroy the evidence of Thul's misdeeds before Ulgo was able to distribute it. Thul's secrets are safe. Never in my entire life have I been so relieved. Here is a reward from House Thul. You've done a great thing for the Empire. I hope you realize that. I am Lord Malachos. I was told you were coming and was given some background information. Your exploits prove you are capable, but I require more. I don't, under I don't understand what you're saying. Oh, oh. The Organas have sent spies and several Padawan Jedi here to scout the Ulgo's fortress. I need the Organas dispatched. Why do the Ulgos work for them? The Ulgos, like the Organas, believe they can fight one another under the pretense of rules which both nobly adhere to. Cha kulka dumaji tahus hagwa upa. This is why the Organas must be shocked into hating the Ulgos more than the there. Empire or House Thule. Disgust is our weapon. If the Ulgos will not provide a sufficient outrage, a sufficient atrocity, we, that is you, must do it for them. I doubt they will cleave to their precious rules once their opponents do not. Exactly. Your assignment is to kill the Padawan Jedi and scouts of the Organas. The ultimate goal is for the Organas to exhaust themselves, bringing war to the Olgo's doorstep. Revulsion is the first step in this plan. I will give you atrocities in abundance. Enthusiasm is good, but I do not suggest improvisation. Oh, well, we that's have here kind a of my kit thing. containing common implements Olgo soldiers carry. These items will give the act the homemade authenticity needed to convince a skeptical observer. <laughs> kill the Jedi, kill the Organas, use the tools provided, and return here. Oh, I will return. It is not so difficult if you have the will. My lord, please stand by a moment. I have urgent orders to put you into contact with my superior, Darth Victus. Ah, you've arrived, finally. Oh, yes, I'm told it took that forever. you served Darth Zash well in your time as her apprentice. Oh, I served. I am Darth Victus. Our Empire has need of you, Sith. Here and now. Right now? Oh, wonderful. What is with all the guys in this camp? Every single one of these Sith is like, Oh, hello! What the hell? Depends on what you want me to do. The task at hand involves House Pantia, the weakened former rulers of Alderaan. Though most believe them wiped out, a few stragglers yet survive. 
These surviving Panteers are needed to legitimize House Thule's eventual rule. We are creating an understanding with them even now, but the forces of House Ulgo plan to interfere. Yawn. Your amusement is not my concern. Ulgo has strike teams massing Thranta for transport. Trees, we intend oh to no. assault the Panteers Mountain hideaway and slaughter all surviving members of the House. The eradication of House Pantheer would greatly impede our plans for House Thule's ascendance. It cannot be allowed. You will find the Ogo strike teams and destroy them at once. There will be no survivors. I would accept nothing less. When it is done, report back to Lieutenant Muir. We will continue our discussion then. Farewell. Good luck. Clever trick, Sith. Getting Rahana to call me down here like it was some sort of emergency. It was pretty clever. But frankly, I'm insulted. Where's Rahana? Uh, You've gone through no effort to disguise your trap. Hmm. Give me the key to Organa's vault. I know what you want, Sith. It's the very object my family has sworn to protect. I cannot permit that vile artifact to fall into Sith hands. Unlike you. I am a person of principle. Oh, I can get him with, but not of your word. Vile artifact. Huh. What, what, whatever will I choose? Killing you will be such fun. The light will prevail, Sith. Even against darkness as black as yours. Oh, damn! Uh, Kem, you could have just attacked him. You don't have to wait for me, bro. So sorry to interrupt. I hope your meeting with Lady Wrist went well. You could say that. I was able to persuade her to my way of seeing things. You'll have your artifact soon, then. I'm glad to hear it. Like I said, I'm very sorry to trouble you, but we have a problem on our hands, and you may be the only one. Everyone has problems. It. Get with it, lady. The galaxy's at war. As usual. If I had 50 credits for every time someone said that. I have intelligence that Organa is preparing a reprisal for your raid on House Alder. According to our spy, Organa has assembled a contingent of Jedi to attack House Thul. I sent Ertl and his Sith to investigate, but they haven't returned. Oh no! You should have asked me first. I didn't want to impose. I had no idea Organa's Jedi was so powerful. Please, all I ask is that you locate and take out Organa's Jedi contingent within House Organa before they have a chance to strike. And if you could find out what happened to Ertl and the other Sith, I would appreciate that as well. But the Jedi are first priority. There will be no survivors. Thank you. And I assure you, House Thul is a generous ally. Thule also has a vault in the Elysium, and the key will be yours. Once our safety is assured, Organa will expect an attack and be heavily guarded. Please hurry. I don't know how much time we have.
just received word from House Organa. They want a temporary truce. Apparently you were too much for them. Your people are hurting. It's a shame. He was a valuable asset to our house. He was clearly weak. I suppose strength is all a Sith really cares about. Strength and power. House Thor is once more indebted to the Empire, and of course, to you personally. The Elysium is where the houses keep their dearest treasures. I'm sure you'll find something of value. Thank you again, Sith. House Thule is once more secure. I don't know what would have happened without you. Welcome back. Probes have confirmed the full elimination of Ulgor's strike teams. I will contact Darth Victus immediately. My lord, Lieutenant Muir, the matter is dealt with. Perfect. The Empire is fortunate to have such a capable servant. This accomplishment will be well rewarded. Are we finished? So long as enemies remain to be crushed, the Empire's work is never done. I am currently engaged in negotiations with the Pantheon survivors at their mountain hideaway. I will arrange for you to be allowed inside. Be sure to conduct yourself cautiously. The Pantheon hideaway is neutral soil. They won't tolerate uncalled for aggression. One obstacle still stands before our plans for House Thule. Boris Olgo, the supposed king of Alderaan himself. We'll speak more when you arrive. Farewell, my lord. My scouts tell me you have succeeded and the Organa frequencies are jammed with angry rhetoric. Any reasonable voice, including the Jedi, is being drowned out in their hatred of House Ulgo. <laughs> It is too much to hope they will come to blows, but this revulsion will serve us well. I'm always a professional. Your pride is deserved. I will monitor the situation as it degenerates. If the fear and hatred last, we will add this to our roster of tactics. The longer they forget about House Thule, the more time we have to maneuver. Then the end game can begin. Good, you've arrived. Allow me to introduce you to Lord Oren Pantier, nephew of the late Queen Celara Pantier, rightful Queen of Alderaan. Your Lordship, this is the hero I spoke to you about. The one who prevented Ulgo's barbarous attack against your noble house. It is an honor to meet you. My family owes you a great debt. You will always be welcome in the home of Pantier. I didn't come here to trade friendly banter. True enough. It certainly isn't why we asked you here. The elimination of House Orgo's strike teams has forced them to draw men from their castle guard. The heart of their house lies exposed. Given your exemplary service in defense of House Pantier, Lord Oren has deigned to grant you an opportunity to shape the future of Alderaan. Boris Ulgo, head of House Ulgo, has betrayed the noble laws of Alderaan and stolen the throne for himself. It will be your task to remove it from him. Is there going to be plenty of death involved? <laughs> this is one of the most heavily guarded men on all of Alderaan. You will find no shortage of foes. Please, do everything within your power to capture Boris Ulgo alive. The people of Alderaan deserve to see that usurper face justice. They deserve... Begging your pardon, my lord. An urgent matter requires your attention. Very well. Tell me what's happened. Captured alive, you will do no such thing. Even in chains, Buris Ulgo is a threat to House Thule's ascendance. He must be killed at all costs. Hmm. Why do we care about Boris Ulgo? He's just one man. Boris Ulgo was a Republic war hero. He only claimed the throne in order to challenge House Thule and the Empire. As long as Boris Ulgo lives, he could influence people against our cause. Remember that. My apologies. 
Thank God now, I didn't hear what that guy just said. You the task being given to you, don't you? Boris Ulgo is at the center of a castle stolen from our Those house. damn trees! Surrounded by an army of loyal troops. Until now, no one has dared challenge his position. The look on his face when I blast him to his knees will be priceless. We waited so long. This will be a momentous day. I must make preparations. I'll arrange for a special detachment of our elite Queen's Guard to move in behind you and collect the usurper once the, the Queen's job is done. They're Good fabulous! Luck. Do not fail us. And here we are. It's just as I predicted. A mere tool of the Sith Empire, just like the beasts in House Thule. Sent to wrench the throne of Alderaan away from those who rightfully possess it. Uh, you should yeah. save your breath. You may not have much more of it. If you think that I will fail now, then you are gravely mistaken. I was the only one strong enough to do what was necessary. The people of this world deserve a leader who will defend them. I will not surrender this throne for you or for anyone else. Only I can keep it safe. Only I can protect Alderaan! It's past time I ended you. I believe I've tolerated your intrusion long enough. Oh, damn! Destroy this assassin men! Defend uh... your king! Defend Alderaan! <laughs> Okay, uh, we have to take out the pillars, I guess. Yes? So, here. Come, come! Oh, uh, 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 inanimate objects! This is glowing. I assume this is like some type of. Oh, it's a giant rocket launcher? Oh, sweet stickles. Here we go. That was awesome. So, once you blow it up, guys come out of the doors or something. Terrific. Grab my big old gun. Why they keep these here, I do not know. I should have planned for something like this, huh? All the way over here. Oh, I probably shouldn't. Oh, I can! Back up, Cam. Back up. Slowly. Slowly. And. Go and get him! Grab this last one, and this should be it. Damn it, they're gonna come from the door. Aye. Sweet. Sight is like. 
Okay. Do pimp walk heal? Pimp walk heal. Where am I going? Just straight ahead, huh? we go! Ow! What the hell? Not over. I'm not dead yet. Uh, I won't let you, you win. I won't let the Empire's shadow fall over Alderaan. It will. So ends the reign of Boris Ulgo. For Alderaan! For me! <laughs> Area secure, everyone. Looks like the hard part's been taken care of. Is that Phil Lamar's That's his voice? Boris Olgo has finally been defeated. The usurper's reign has finally ended. Lord Oren, the mission was a success. Boris Olgo is dead. Dead? Hmm. That's no more than that traitor deserved, I suppose. Lord Victus, our house owes you and house Thule a great debt. You are very gracious. Oh, so Lordship. gracious. We are only too happy to grind this treacherous scum under heel on behalf of the people of Alderaan. Isn't that right? Oh, yes, that, that's, that's, that's totally right. A bit of violence always cheers me up. Ah, yes, well, good. You have removed Boris Ulgo from the throne and proved House Thule's commitment to the future of Alderaan. So, you will have my support. Will your influence be enough to persuade those misled brothers and cousins of yours who have sided with House Organa. I'll do my best, but the Organos may not take well to losing. I fear this conflict could be far from over. After all that I've done, House Thule's position still isn't secure. It is only a matter of time. You should be satisfied that you have I'm the opportunity to play such a large all. role. Your work is done for the time being. You can go on about your own business. House Pantir will never forget what you've done for us. Thank you. Seriously. I hate every last one of you houses on Alderaan. I wish you'd just blow up. Got time to chat? Odd. You never struck me as one for idle conversation. Haven't been aboard too long. Like to know who I'm working with. Nothing touchy feely. Just enough to know you got my back. You get my back, I'll get yours. Simple as that. We see eye to eye. Just one more thing. 
You ever butt heads with the Republic, let me have a shot. I got a score to settle, and it'll be a long time before I call it even. Ah, Apprentice. You have the artifact. Wonderful. And Lady Fool sends her thanks once more for your aid against Organa's Jedi. I only did it for the prize. And won an important victory. Lady Fool is a vital ally to the Empire. By all accounts, you have a very promising future ahead of you, Apprentice. Now that you've found the last of the artifacts, I hope to see you on Droman Kars as soon as possible. We still have much work to do. You're looking for Sash. Well, she's not here. Allow me to introduce myself. Darth Thanaton. Don't worry. I haven't done anything to your master. I'm far too interested in how this game she's playing will turn out. I've waited a long time to meet you. Your rise from the slave pens has been non-traditional to say the least. Is there a problem with where I came from? Others have risen from slavery to do great things. I'm not concerned with your origins. The trials on Korriban are an honored tradition designed to sift out the unworthy. I trust they've served their purpose. I want to speak to you about your master. That seems to be everyone's favorite subject these days. Really? I'd love to hear what everyone has to say. Darth Zash is arrogant and reckless. The Reckless have a way of defeating themselves in the end. When she finally self-destructs, be careful not to get caught in the blast. A young Sith should not associate himself too closely with a master like Zash. That's all right. I'm going to kill her anyway. Uh, I will pretend I didn't hear that. Oh, you heard it! Seek your own way. Carve out your own victories. The culty one on Nar Shaddaa was a good first step, but it's not enough. A Sith cannot live without a power base. Good luck. My child, your power has grown since we last met. Your strength will rise and shape the Sith. I feel it. Now, I have another gift for you. One that was dearer to me than even my life. My own lightsaber, until now, lost to me, but through your great power in the Force, I have found it. You must claim it. So where do I find this lightsaber? I entrusted it to my faithful retainer, Jonas Eskimos, the only servant who didn't betray me when Tulek Horde moved against me. He swore he and his heirs would keep it safe until the time that my heir would return to claim it. His heir is on Nar Shaddaa, working in one of the casinos there. Her name is Mila Eskimos. Go to her and claim your inheritance. <laughs>